Hi, YouTubers, right here. Um, oops, put my back up. This isn't my best fish in the room, but this one I picked up actually. It's one I've had a long time. Just trying to say hi. Um, I know you guys have seen one of these things right here. You know, a Game Boy Advance. You pick them up. I got these. I got literally this back in the balance. I'm not kidding. They pretty much run on batteries practically. Double A's or chargeables. Probably find one of these little cheap. One game I looked on Pac-Man, um, Pac-Man Museum. Well, it's got this game on there. Well, basically, that, that's the game I got in there. Put it kind of close to the screen there so you can tell what the heck you read. Pretty much. It's got that game in there. I'm going to turn on for you. Turn it up. Close the screen right there. Oops, you can see the thing. It's got a game on here I like. It's got a game on the Pac Pac-Man arrangement. Well, can't adjust this thing. Oh, can I? Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pac-Man arrangement. Pac-Man on that one. Weird thing about full screen. You gotta go to two screens to see this stupid thing. You go full. It was really small. Pack attack. Pack attack is basically Pac-Man Tetris, pretty much. Pac-Man Mania. This is the one I like. Let me see here. Now. You're gonna press start button. Let's see. Okay, that's a little hang. You're gonna put. A, oops. Hit that button again. You're gonna go to main menu. No, we're gonna go start again. Quick game, yes. Now, when you're on the front screen, to all screen of this game, front, front screen, my back end arrangement. It's the reason for it. Sorry, I got bad angles there all over the place. When you're on the front screen, I pack my arrangement and showing all the ghosts. Press start, go down to settings, go over to easy, lives, give yourself a whole bunch. Go left, the left one says 40 and 100k. Push done, push continue. And play the game. I'm gonna try to zoom this in the best possible. I'm playing this really backwards, that kid. I think I spoiled the lighting. <laughs> We're not actually physically looking at it, it's a whole lot easier. By the way, that's all the way up actually. <laughs> it probably sounds different on the computer screen, just the audio. If I just plugged into like some kind of stereo system, we can do that with an old how they car stereo back in the day. Yeah, you can do that here. Make it louder. This one actually has a, this one, this one's really good though. Basically, you zoom around the maze and you gotta collect them pretty much, and they give you a lot of levels. At the end, if you stay long enough for like six or seven worlds, you actually have to fight a boss. That's quite difficult. Crown clear. I'll get myself the next level. You can probably look up the stuff on YouTube, anyways. Mm -hmm. But basically, it's pretty much all you do in the game. And every level has some kind of different music and they do different things in it. This is the original Pac Man arrangement. So, there you go. I'm going to push start to put the game. Yes. Ah, you son of a gun. Got a main menu that I put the game actually. So, aim for full screen. Look how small that screen is. Holy cow. Oh, that's a screen. <laughs> yeah. oh. 
That's my tutorial on if you ever pick up this game, basically. Pick it up on Game Boy Advance, Pac-Man Collection. It's got a bunch of stuff in there, trust me. Pac-Man Arrangements by one game I like. You know how in Pac-Man you're always dying? Well, this one, continuous screen comes up, just push A. Not kidding. You only, you only die when you quit the darn thing, actually. When you actually physically quit it. If you never physically quit it, you're never going to die. And you just keep on going, keep on going. The only bad thing is, if you want to get a little hard, leave it on hard and give yourself a life. Take you 90 minutes or more to beat the game. Give yourself a lot of life, and then after a while, you get used to it. Because the background, the way this stuff happens, the way this stuff happens in that game, it's awesome. I picked it up for six bucks before they went out. Of, before they went out, went out. Before the Game Boy Advance went out of um, GameStop, <laughs> I just picked it up by the six dollars. I put my initials on the front game. Um, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Basically, moving my mouse around. Um, this one to say bye. Um, that's about it. If you like the tortilla, you want some more, let me know. Thank you. It's, by the way, it's on Game Boy Advance. It's called, what is it? Pac-Man Collection. You can go look it up on YouTube. I feel like it better views than that. Um, I think it works in the DS Lite that I believe they play Game Boy Advance games. But it's a fun game and one of my preferred Pac-Man games. You don't die. Well, you do die. The ghosts are still get fast to get kind of weird after a while, but downright fun. Mm -hmm. You can go back and kill it in just about as good as you can. It's basically it plays like Pac-Man, pretty much. I find it for six bucks. I don't know how much you're going to find it.